Absolutely beautiful. Another piece of the puzzle in place, ready to go, and there's only two more of those to put up, but they're going to be the tricky ones. Have to figure out how I'm standing those up because I can't pull them over from the one way. They're going to have to be tipped into the building, so that's going to be a little bit of a challenge with the uh, shear legs on those. I'm not, I have not decided yet, but I might enlist a little bit of help on those and maybe raise them by hand instead of the shear legs. They're not terribly heavy. I mean, they're only eight by eights, so they're a lot lighter than anything else that's been put on this structure. But uh, after that, we don't have too many more timbers left that we have to cut. So, I mean, cut joinery in, and that's gonna be, uh, what, what are we gonna do videos on after that? that that's gonna be a good question. The, uh, I'm trying, I'm in a mad dash to get this done before hay in season, because once hay in season hits, this project takes a back seat because we got to make sure our animals are fed and I do not want this thing opened up for another season. It just it needs to get finished. But uh, anyway, it was enjoyable. I'm sorry I haven't been talking as much through these videos. I've covered it so many times and I'm kind of just concentrating on what I'm doing, especially when I'm raising that stuff up. I, I need to really focus on what I'm doing so... I can pay attention if something starts to go south, I can get out of the way, and sometimes when I talk I get a little distracted. I found myself many times in the course of making these videos talking about something and finding out I'm screwing it up because I'm missing a measurement or something like that because I'm thinking about what I'm trying to say and things like that. But uh, also, don't forget, we are doing our... Uh, our three channel shout out for this week. We're going to be doing it in every single video this week. I'll probably give it a couple days longer because we got off on that. Um, still have to do the live feed. We've got, we have Homegrown Country Homestead. We have Homestead Handyman and we have the Great Plains Craftsman. Three pretty good channels that you guys might enjoy watching. I know a lot of my viewers here, uh, probably a lot of you watch the Fouches and channels like that and these are kind of similar and uh, or at least one of them's pretty similar the other one's a shop type video and there was actually a mouse that just ran in here i don't know how they're getting in but they're getting in oh <laughs> that's a joke for the guy who's going to hit the thumbs down on this you bastard but anyway great plains craftsman he's getting on his journey to homesteading so i encourage you to go check tim out and see what he's up to he's doing some tool restorations that are really good and uh, actually some really good information in there and like i said before a lot of these folks are newer at this, so go easy on them and just keep that in mind. They're learning just as I am learning. And on another note, thank you to all the new viewers. We crossed the threshold. We crossed 7,000 subs today, this morning. So that's a really good feeling. I really appreciate that that many of you have an interest in what I'm doing here. It, you guys are really helping me out on this. Uh, like I said it before, you have no idea. I, I would not be able to get my materials to finish this project if it wasn't for these videos and the motivation it gives me to see it through because I know so many people are looking for this thing to be finished. But we're at a point now where I put so much work into it, I'm not going back now. So anyway, thanks for watching everybody. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you uh, liked it, please comment, like, subscribe. All three of those actions helps the channel out. And if you're the dirty rat bastard who puts the thumbs down on every video, I hope you have a wonderful evening stubbing your toe in the darkness of your own hallway. Now, 
Have a good night, everybody. I will see you on the next one.